20th century physics largely developed around two big theories. There's quantum mechanics, which describes atoms, molecules, and subatomic particles. And then there's Einstein's theory of gravity, which is applied to stars, galaxies, and the universe as a whole. If you try to put the two theories together, you run into problems, mathematical contradictions, because the nonlinear mathematics Einstein used in developing his theory is not well suited is not well suited for the needs of quantum theory. Now, it doesn't really make sense to have one theory for big objects, stars, galaxies, and the whole universe, and another theory for atoms and subatomic particles, because ultimately, for example, a star is made out of atoms, electrons, protons, and neutrons. So whatever are the laws that determine what individual electrons, protons, and neutrons do, when applied in the large to many, many particles, will tell you the behavior of a star. So there's a need in physics to reconcile quantum theory that we use for the small things with Einstein's theory of 